Do you want to see me? I do. Just why did you put that story in the paper? To keep you from throwing yourself away? Well, can we call a truce? Maybe. If you decided to stop making a fool of yourself. Then suppose I haven't. Then I'll keep right on haunting you. But why? What do you care what I do? I don't. Only, you see, I promised Pops I'd keep you away from Pearson. It's, uh, it's nice work. I like it. And, uh, suppose I told you that I'd given up the idea of marrying Jack? I wouldn't believe you. Not even if I said that your coming here had made me change my mind? Well, Miss Allen, this is so sudden. Are you awfully sure you're doing all this for Pops? Hmm. Nice going. No wonder they fall. You're the most aggravating man I've ever met. Well, you haven't been around much. Oh, yes, I have. Not with the right people. And how would the right people treat me? Kiss you less and slap you more. Why don't you try it? Because you couldn't take it. Which? The kiss or the slap? Neither. Begin. No. No, no, I, I saw you cry once. You were most unattractive. That's lesson one. The teacher? I thought you said you were going to kiss me. This is the way I'd do it. Well, uh, school's over. We, we'd better go back. No, teach me lesson two. No, no, this is recess. Butch. We, we'd better go back. I will if you'll dance with me. Why? I want them all to see us together. All right. I wonder who Butch really is. Jack says Kay's going to introduce him publicly after this dance. Don't they? Well, wait till you see him after the payoff. Come on, you take care of Butch. You uh, promised this one to me, Kate. Uh, not now, Jack. The next one. Always keep your promises, darling. Send it. Well, everything's all set. Fanfare, drums, and you spring the payoff. Maybe I shouldn't have told you, but... I like you much too much to have her make a fool of me. There's your exit march. Yeah, thanks. May I see you for a minute, darling? Oh, Butch, of course. Lesson two. What? Stop it! Oh, you, you people are watching! Will you stop? Oh, you, you beast! 